for the last couple of weeks after I got bit by some bugs uh, when traveling. <sighs> I'm functioning, I'm alive, but deep down I feel so exhausted. <laughs> Don't worry, there is a happy ending and I'm gonna share with you how I healed myself and how you can too. It did something to my body and my lymphatic system has been trying to clear it and I feel the nodes and uh, just feel so exhausted like I've just been going on and hoping that it would just clear and get better and uh, yeah I didn't because I wasn't even doing my regular health practices because I just felt so tired and I had like no time. I know that's an excuse, you gotta make time obviously. And the situation is feeling me and re-reminding me of the importance of health. To value myself and the work that I do in the world. That I can take myself out of this and that I can support others in taking themselves out of it as well and how important it is to feel good. Wow, so I actually feel like an entirely new human being. <laughs> Yesterday to today is like night and day. Um, wow. I'm so relieved that I rose above whatever problems or challenges my body was facing in the past. That's so done. And uh, I really got on it. Like I went to the doctors and I got some antibiotic thing and uh, lymphatics and homeopathics and naturopath and this really intense detox yoga that helps my body purge all the toxins out um, from the bugs and African dancing and laughing and getting amazing healing sessions. And I feel that I'm literally vibrating at a whole other frequency and whatever was in my body before me it was maybe like parasites or some kind of systemic infection. Um, that's vibrating here and now I'm there. And I'm doing my practices, morning and evening routines and everything, recharging in the morning, winding down at night feeling good, being in nature, sitting to meditate, taking the time to connect, drawing my cards, getting the divine messages for the day, and I just feel so grateful to be back feeling good, and wow, feels so good to be on the other side, thank god, wow, and to be even more upgraded with my health, and to have new tools now to use in my health and to help others. So I'm so glad this whole thing happened. Oh my God. And if you're in some kind of health problem situation, I understand what you're going through completely. And I know that there's pe different people are gonna tell you different things and that this doctor's gonna say that and that pharmacist is gonna say that and this person gonna say that. Um, and really just take it all in and you kind of have to put together like a puzzle it's all these different pieces um, and it's your intuition that can glue it together so always check with your inner guidance of what really resonates with you and don't jump to crazy conclusions and start googling a bunch of stuff and freak yourself out and have crying outbursts not that i did that yesterday or anything but um that's what not to do so don't do that um, just stay calm and centered and trust that you can rise above this. Whatever sickness or exhaustion or crap is in your body is there and you just need to get there. Everything's energy, everything's vibration. So what are you going to do to get from there to there? What daily practices are you going to do? What kind of food are you going to eat? What kind of people are you going to hang out with? What kind of movement are you doing? Are you sweating? Get in that sauna, get to an African dance class, get to a drum circle, sweat it out, release it, journal it out, burn it, go to the doctor, get a blood test. That is holistic. I, the insights that you need and then also see your holistic healthcare practitioners to help when you know what you have and when you know what's going on 
then you can do more holistic things to bring yourself back into balance. So my golden nuggets for today are getting to the vibration where that disease cannot exist because it just it doesn't resonate with where you're at and daily practices morning routine and evening routine write them out do it put it on a little cue card i look at it i say okay here's what i gotta do here i'm doing it da -da -da. and uh it just it's so helpful because if you wake up in the morning and you just jump right into the day into the work day or into facebook or into your emails then like your whole energy is just <laughs> gets scattered and it's like Good luck you just like jump right into chaos and uh it's nice to just take the time to recharge with yourself to just connect and hear the divine messages i was uh dancing for about five hours today so uh i'm just sweating a little bit <laughs> and at night winding down winding down relaxing then you're gonna sleep better right if you go to bed when you're all mm, you're gonna lie in bed and be like that wind yourself down relax make a nice bedtime tea do a little gentle stretching have like a cleansing shower or bath and just ask that whatever from the day be purified it's all about intention just set whatever intention it is that you want and the energy will flow if you intend it and you ask it and you communicate with yourself and with the universe and with whatever it is that you believe in god angels guides whatever crew you're rolling with just connect with them and ask them they're there for you you're not alone you have so much love and support with you and uh, it's a beautiful journey. Oh, life is good. I'm so glad to feel good again. I'm so grateful for my health and I'm so amazed at how quickly that shifted from yesterday to today. It was just, it's so done. It's gone. It's completely gone. Hallelujah. <laughs>